Hello everyone, I'm Santiago Santiago, and today I'm going to be testing Watch Dogs Legion. Thanks to Ubisoft for providing a copy of the game. The first thing that I should get out of the way, I wasn't able to get 60 frames per second, even on a Ryzen 5 3600. You probably need something with higher single threaded performance, so to get closer to 60, I'll probably use an i5 10400F or something in that range. So yeah, no way for me to get 60s even in a 2060 on the lowest settings at 720p using these CPUs. Mostly driving and looking at water on daytime are the issues. That's one issue that they didn't fix yet on the latest patch, is when you're looking at water, the frame rate is significantly affected. This happens even more if you're using an AMD GPU. The RX 570 and 580 were the ones that suffered the most when looking at water, but I noticed it was fixed when using DX11. The issue with DX11 is that it uses significantly more CPU and it stutters much more. So for most people I recommend using DirectX 12, so you use less CPU, you get less stutters, but you got that issue when looking at water, so pick your poison, basically. Then another thing that this game uses a lot of is the VRAM, video memory. If you have an Nvidia card with 4GB, use medium. If you have more than 4 gigs, use high, and if you got 8 gigs or more, use ultra. Then if you have 2 gigabytes, use the lowest texture quality option. On the AMD GPU side of things, the game seems to be using more video memory. So for 4 gigabyte cards, I will use low textures. Then if you have 6 gigs, use medium. And if you have 8 gigs, use high or ultra. Ultra is a little bit too overkill but it should still be doable on 8GB GPUs on the AMD side. For the testing I'll start driving in the city, since that destroys the performance in general. Then I'll be looking at water for a few seconds to show you the performance impact. And then just a little bit of combat, with some explosions in the middle. That will be my test on basically all the GPUs in this game. So my advice in this situation, if you don't have a good enough CPU to maintain 60 frames per second, is to aim for 30 frames. It should be pretty easy on most CPUs out there, even for core for threat things. So yeah guys, that's about it. I hope you keep enjoying the video. Thanks for watching and see you next time.
near your location. 